If you like shopping, real estate, or both, you should come to Texas. Let me tell you why. In today's episode of Joe's Rendering Reviews, we're taking a look at major renovations coming to two huge malls in Texas. I've got my Texas shirt on and I've got my Bucky's Beaver in honor of the best place to shop in the Lone Star State. So let's get into it. Any Austin mall rat knows about the domain. Opened in 2007, this mall is one of the city's biggest and best, covering 1.2 million square feet in one of the busier neighborhoods for new development. The mall was 94% leased at the end of last year, but 16 years on, it's getting a bit old. It's facing competition from other places like Music Lane on South Congress. So its owner, Simon Malls, recently started renovations to get things up to snuff. Work started in June, and the company plans to renovate 11 storefronts. These new renderings give us the first look at what to expect. Admittedly, the square lines and multicolored facades look a bit like the gentrification building trend, which isn't the most exciting design style, but I do love to see apartments over retail. One of my biggest gripes about the domain as a larger neighborhood is that it feels a little sterile, so this should give it a new human element. Here we've got more street level shopping, this time with a white and gray marble type exterior accent. It also gives us a look at the types of tenants that Simon is hoping to bring to the mall. There's the Lenciaga store, I assume that means Balenciaga. Public filings suggest that Dior, Versace, and Burberry are also planning to move into the mall soon. As part of the redevelopment, Simon's upgrading Century Oaks Plaza, which is a pocket park in the mall. It reminds me of Waterloo Park, which is an amazing new green space near the Capitol that is easily one of my favorite parks in a city that has no shortage of them. I wonder if they're planning any programming here or if that elevated stage is just a place for some extra special seating. SJE Architects is the architect of record on this renovation and they've previously worked with Simon on the Northeast Mall in Hearst. They're also working with GHA and Rundle Ernst Berger Associates. Next up, we have the shops at Willow Bend in Plano. Centennial, which is a Dallas-based development firm specializing in retail, plans to redevelop the mall this year. It will add apartments, a hotel, and open-air shops while taking down the mall's north side. The property covers 107 acres, so there's plenty of land to work with. Centennial bought the mall with Colley Partners and Waterfall Asset Management last year, and said that it was too big when it was built, hence the whole tearing down the north side thing. So there it is. Texas Mall Rats, get ready to shop until you drop. Thanks for watching Joe's rendering reviews.